I use the deep glow effect by plugging everything all the time for all my glow needs. However, it has one annoying quirk when working with solid or footage layers. At least as of now, using version 1.52. Let's say in this image I wanted to isolate the money bag and add deep glow to it. I duplicate the layer and I mask off section of the image that I want to add glow to, and when I add deep glow, this happens. The glow gets cut off by the bounding box area of the mask. Now the obvious workaround is just to pre-comp the layer to bring the mask inside the pre-comp and add deep glow on the pre-comp layer. But then you're left with an extra pre-comp that you don't really need or want. So let's undo. There's a hacky way you can trick After Effects so it would expand the bounding box of the layer. You need another mask that will at least cover the area of your glow. The easiest way is to double click on the rectangular mask icon to create a mask that covers the whole layer and set its opacity to zero. Now the mask is essentially turned off and isn't doing anything, but the bounding box of the layer has been extended to the full layer, so Deep Glow can use that to draw its glow, or something like that. I don't know, it works. You can then draw more masks on this layer, and the glow will work as it should. To be fair, if you have a similar layer bounding box related problem on other effects, you can probably use this technique to fix that too.